Hello, this is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can get us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com and you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Today I want to show you a cool telephone that we've uh, been working on and there's a couple of other videos of this telephone. This is Mick's telephone and he's from Illinois. and. Um, this is a PTT telephone and uh, we did some body work on this telephone. It had some issues um, on the bottom here and we got that taken care of. There was a couple of other um, problems around the edge in the back of the phone. We got that all squared away. Um, the other thing that was going on with this telephone is uh, Mick had purchased a uh, pulse to tone generator and we were going to connect it inside the telephone and it never did really work properly it just didn't work well with this telephone uh, I also had a tone uh, or a pulse to tone generator that I tried to use on it and it just did not want to accept it and we never got the satisfaction uh, that we wanted out of this telephone so Mick said well is there any way that uh, you can have a, a little unit that uh, I can dial out in tone if I want to and so basically that's how this uh, unit was uh, built. Uh, I went ahead and took a project box and uh, cut all the uh, all the holes out for the buttons um, and we have a unit here where we can plug it in um, I've got a few things that I need to touch up here and clean up but basically we have a modular port here um, that we are going to unplug this line cord from or this handset cord so now what we have is uh, a unit that can be unplugged and plugged back in just like that so we can uh, take it away from the phone if we want. Uh, I got a few things that I need to explain. This is all going to be uh, stabilized inside the telephone. So uh, the telephone has a line cord. You go ahead and plug the line cord up. You can plug this unit in. But we're going to go ahead and do some tests on this telephone. And uh, I'll explain what this uh, piece here is here in a second. So let's do that. Let's go ahead and take the telephone and I'll show you the inside there was some uh, other things that were done to this telephone also but right now we're kinda doing a check out on the uh, the tone uh, dialer so let's go ahead and uh, ring the phone here real quick Let it go one more time. There's your dial tone. And I'm going to reach around and I'm going to... This will be dialing out in pulse. Just going to hit a couple of numbers. There's a 2. I'm going to do a 6. Here's a 2. Here's a 6, and back to 2. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and hang up. And since we have our tone uh, dialer connected, what I'm going to do is go ahead and go through the numbers real quick. And there's a PTT button on the top of this telephone that you would push. And uh, now what we have done is we have made this button redial. Mick thought that that would be a cool redial button, and I do too. So we went ahead and did that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hang up, and I'm going to hit this button. So that all works.
worked out real well. Hang up. Go ahead and dial some numbers. And then star, zero, pound. Uh, these are not marked. Uh, they can always be marked, but most of the time everyone knows that uh, star and uh, it goes star, zero, pound. Star, zero, pound. Star, zero, pound. Hang up. Hit redial. And the other thing that I wanted to talk about was when this telephone uh, is connected to this box, what we have to do here is I'm going to set the video down. When we unplug this, we're going to lose uh, our our tone. So basically, what uh, or our uh, telephone. So basically, what you have to do is I have made a blank plug here. And you can simply, if you want to take the uh, tone dialer, if you want to take that away from the phone and then take the uh, modular cord out and say you just didn't want to use the tone or, or something or you wanted to you know, get, you know, take it out of the line, all you have to do is take this blank plug that I made and then you got your dial tone back. Okay, this part will be inside the telephone mounted, and uh, we'll get that all squared away. We're just kind of going through it a little bit. Uh, there is another way to totally get rid of the um, the cord here if you wanted to, and what that would consist of is simply uh, moving this red wire right here over to where you'd take this green one off but you'd move this red wire over to this connection of the block and you could totally take um, this will be mounted inside here we'll, we'll mount this in here like that but you could totally take the wire off but you'll see here I have dial tone right now if I unplug this and it's going to nothing as you can see I'll lose dial tone and what you would have to do uh, is you would have to jump out or move this red wire over to the green and now you have dial tone again so you, in a sense you could just take off what's been done and that'll get your telephone all by itself again so anyway this is just kind of a little look at what's going on we need to clean up the uh, tone dialer a little bit and um, mount the plug the modular port for the handset that runs over and, and gets the tone uh, dialer and so what this what this line does in a sense and I'm going to disconnect this uh, blank plug what this does in a sense is it connects the line to the to the dialer and um, also catches the uh, the switch for redial at the phone. I'm going to go ahead and plug this back in. I'm going to try to do that one-handed. And then we'll have this uh, a line like this, a handset cord like this, running out of the telephone. Go ahead and simply plug this in. If I can get that plugged in. Now we have our dial tone back. And this is the cover. What we're going to do is plug into a regular line. And I'm going to call like a time and temp number. Good afternoon. Shop our entire location online anytime at Offenberg.com. Today is Saturday, November 6th. The time is 2.33. Current temperature 62 degrees. So there you go. Um, we're all squared away and it worked out real well. 
and then I'm going to hit the redial because I, I was over in the other line and I called the time temp number. So let me hit redial. And that'll be the number that re was dialed and it re just redialed it. So basically it all worked out real well. We just got a few loose ends that we have to tie up. We want to uh, we want to stabilize and mount this uh, plug, this modular port plug for the handset cord. We're going to run some type of a handset cord out of the telephone. This is more for uh, just a test cord. Uh, we may use it, we may not, I don't know, but we will have a, a line running out. And uh, if you want to take the box away from the telephone, you just simply unplug it. Uh, your cord will be hanging here somewhere and then you can plug in the blank cord and that will give you your dial tone to your phone again. Or you can simply remove you can simply remove uh, the cord altogether uh, by a simple connection back here and um, so it all worked out real well now he can dial out in uh, tone and with this telephone and he can also get rid of this box and move it away uh, if he chooses to uh, but it's nice to have this option so this is uh, what it looks like on the inside basically it was just a project box that we had to uh, build a keypad for and uh, connect it all up and make our connections to make it hot so it would dial out so we'll get that all squared away and um, put back together again and get this telephone back to Mick. This is a really cool PTT telephone and uh, it'll have a redial, this little button here will be as redial when the uh, tone box, dialing box is connected. You simply be able to, or you can dial in, in, uh, in rotary. You can dial either way you want. Or you can come up and hit your tones when it's uh, plugged in. We'll go ahead and go back to that real quick and show you that. Or you can come over here and dial. You can dial either way you want. What's cool about it is, is your redial will be up there that the cover's not on good enough to hit the button. But basically you get the ideal and uh, when, the, when the phone is back on its cover the proper way uh, everything will work out. So really what the telephone will look like is uh, you'll have your telephone and then somewhere in the area you'll have your little uh, your uh, tone keypad next to it and uh, that'll work out real well because he can dial out in tone we just weren't getting the satisfaction that we needed out of these uh, pulse to tone generators and it wasn't working out for us so we decided to uh, go with something like a, a tone keypad that we could dial out with when we needed the tone functions and uh, so it all worked out real well. This is Dennis with A1 Telephone Service and Repair, A1 Electronics. You can get us on the web at www.a1-telephone.com. And you can also reach us at 618-235-6959. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.